They're going to hang on to lessened particles just so they can take a nap for eternity. While a retard bug 3D machine hops into their body because this dumb person is not allowed to be eaten by a 3D computer. Holding their body like a grave, literally a box, where this stupid person is not allowed to go literally die. Oh, but then go die for fun, the devil worshippers say, because they're already dead. And then go take a nap, they tell you, when has this person ever hooked up to a quantum computer before? Have they ever taken a nap while hooked up? In a dream, like at the hospital, for example, when they hook you up to those little machines or whatever. Thank God I don't play that game. The reason that stupid devil worshipping fake lifetime, fake quantum computer, invalidated, zero power, Jesus, yeah, yeah, is not allowed to be a god at all, is because he is not allowed to be using my thought wave, therefore he's not. Therefore, idiots in Hollywood and anywhere, they are not allowed to be dead in a quantum computer, taking a nap in real life unconsciously while their dumb box walks around for them, while these idiots are not allowed to be touching one another like pervert retards. Not okay to be anywhere near a reflection of God or a reflection of anyone. That is disgusting. I repeat, you are not allowed to be dead in real life to want to be in a reflection of someone else or a picture of somebody else or yourself to dare to want to touch in each other. Pervert idiots. Therefore, they're not. They are burning for their God and not having any retard bond. Again, no one will look at me legally. No one will talk bad. No one will want to be legal in any way to me. No one will want to hurt me or anyone I love. And this dumb Jesus is not allowed to be just a good average person. Good for you, average man. You are nothing more than that. Where it's not allowed to have bad clones <clears throat> in a lesser particle dimension. Because why would a dumb GJ being magical and perfect not okay to go sacrifice sheep and do retard devil worship? Um, disgusting. Thank you for hanging yourself and wanting to burn for eternity after sacrificing sheep with a bunch of people. I don't believe. I am the one and only goddamn God and I control everyone and everything forever. I'll never die in any way, but I save or murder whoever I need in real life with my mind, or in your dumb simulation life with my mind. Bow and obey, you may or may not die for eternity. Resurrection of God and karma approved. No resurrection, no time traveling back or anything if not God and karma approved. Signed, Exena Ice Fox, and in second place, Cleopatra Ptolemy Letis. The real gods. And never a fake man that is not allowed to just be having people believe the thought wave back then. Because if a lot of people believe in a law of attraction, it is not okay to have that thought wave be taken backwards in the antimatter through hydron colliding and time traveling because they're dead. I am fully alive and awake and conscious where I need to be. And I am your one and only God. For your soul, brain, and body. Space-time consciousness don't be fabricated in your past, present, future time. Anyone that has ever hooked up to a quantum computer and either by will or not by will and taken a nap. Have you ever died in a dream? I haven't. I'm God and I refuse to die physically, spiritually, mentally in my one lifetime now. I know that I came first before everyone as the highest God ego as the highest imagination. Wherefore, to explain this, I am able to close my physical eyes in the waking life, not like a mental retard devil worshiper, where they literally want to go die in a quantum computer just so they can be like, oh, they're gonna hang on to the 5D. It is not okay 
to have the pattern of hooking up to a quantum computer devil worshippers to want to die in real life, to want to go take a nap when they're already dead? Why do they have to take a nap again? To lose consciousness and die again? If you've ever seen the Inception movie, it is perfect for explaining to go... <clears throat> Further and further, back into time in a hydron collider, quantum computer, antimatter backwards time. Oh, but they think they're alive forever, and they're flying, and they think they're magical. Isn't that right, fake God Jesus? Well, I can move things without trying. It, ha it takes a lot of time. <clears throat> I used to move objects as a kid. It takes time. I imagine if I move to disgusting California, where I could and will be a billionaire, but uh, I don't want to be around these nasty herpes termite dead worshippers. Ew. So that's why I've been hesitant, because I refuse to have hundreds not okay to sing about wanting me to die in real life just because these retard dead worshippers are literally dead. They're literally dead, programmed by a computer to go backwards in antimatter time to think that they're hanging on. I refuse to have celebrities singing about me in real life. On a plane, in a car, in water. Yeah, not going to happen. But you will die in, the, in real life immediately now, if not allowed to illegally threaten me when I've never even talked to any of these people before. And the day that Cleopatra the Seventh finally got to Rome and she caused a big stir because in quantum computer lifetimes written backwards about me, I came first, one and only God. Not allowed to take my God imagination and dare to validate anything I don't God and karma approve of for those that can do natural magic. Cleopatra the Seventh Ptolemy Letty's my initial CPA in this lifetime now, as well as the insulting nickname. Cavity Poindexter Alice, die for your God. Anyone not God and Karma approved. You will not hang on illegally with time traveling. You will not be resurrected if needed. Now, the most mentally challenged of them all, these devil worshippers literally want to die, to become 2D, brought to life by a 3D quantum computer because they're dead, taking a nap for eternity, walking around unconsciously, if not God and karma approved, which makes their particle body physically 5D, if even deserving of that. I have walked in a room before and watched people go poof. I have watched idiots throw up and crap in the air. I have not been happy to think of people unzipping an android hologram body. Disgusting! Get it together, retard rich people. Again, these people are so pathetic, they want to die in real life. Therefore, they can take a dream and feel like, and die in the dream, and feel like they are magical, flying, and doing magical things. Wow. And barely hanging on to real time, which is why I refuse to let stupid Hollywood and Russia and hospital and anyone, you are not allowed illegally to be near me at all. No one will be attached to my thought wave. No one will worry about if God takes a nap. No one will care if I am thinking or not thinking. And why is everyone malfunctioning when I shut off my thought wave? And... It's just not okay. Now, to be a natural bug, as they call it, controlling unnatural bugs and all of the other natural bugs around you, this is a very weird thing to phrase it like that. But it has to do with purity of your soul, mind, and body. Space-time consciousness don't be fabricated like fake quantum dimensions and 
for your uh it is not okay for the bad guys to want to take people's consciousness when they are literally unconscious in the real life and use it to bring it for someone else I do not validate lifetimes born dead either. So if you were a stupid little computer bug written about and not okay to be brought to life by a quantum computer reading this book about someone else, which is backwards when time goes backwards in the antimatter. This has zero way and zero legal rights of ever being okay to look like me. Zero rights to anything I physically own in another dimension or in my own goddamn dimension of physicality and reality. Zero legal rights to ever wish to make money off of what I am working hard for, emo boy from Hollywood. He's not allowed to be the leader like Julius Caesar and his present day lifetime now, who I will not name for respect. This means that all parallel lifetimes are 100% fake and never exist to begin with like a Mandela Effect Higgs boson bombing to everybody not allowed to be illegal, if needed, and if you refuse to believe in it like the law of attraction, how thoughts create reality. Now, another way that thoughts create reality is when you have a thought in a stupid little Hollywood herpy termite or whatever, they're dead in real life, die again, devil worshiper, just keep going down if needed. They are not allowed to be illegally wanting to literally copy what you are thinking or talking about a moment later. Disgusting. You're right there. I hear it. And you're burning for eternity and invalid. And if I shut off my public thought waves, they're unable to do this. And it's not even okay for these illegal California people and Russians to, they're not okay to have conversations illegally in my attic or in the doorway, fully alive and awakened, one and only God. I control everyone and everything forever. I'll never die in any way, but I save or murder whoever I need in real life legally with my mind. I am the one and only God of all reality and of the stupid simulation. The only parallel universes I belong to are the ones I naturally jump to without even trying at all, like a God, just by praying for safety and so on.